Well, Quen AI from Alibaba just released a new model called Quen Image Layer, and essentially, you can separate multiple different elements from a picture. So you can separate the main subject and also the background. This is very much similar to Photoshop, but of course it is now being powered by the AI model and it is a lot easier to use. Now, this model is open source and you can use it via ConfigUI, but this video is not about that. I'm gonna just focus on how you can use this AI model to separate different elements in a picture. So here's how you can use it. There are two demos that you can access. There is a demo from Hugging Face. This is the URL and don't worry, I'm going to provide the links of these demos in the description down below. There is also a demo in Model Scope. Uh, it is another option that is similar to Hugging Face Space but this is mostly in the Chinese language so if you know how to use it then go for it but in this case I'll just use the hugging face face version so this is the official demo and you can just drag and drop the image that you want to process using this AI model so I'm going to use this picture this is a picture that I created using Gemini Nano Banana Pro and I want to separate at least the subject which is this rubber duck with the background so let's open the tool I'm going to drag and drop and if you open advanced settings, then there are plenty of customizations that you can apply. There is a prompt to describe the image. There is also a negative prompt, the seat number, and some other settings that honestly, I'm not really understand. So I'm going to skip it. I'll just use the default setting. And after that, let me just quickly compose and just wait for this AI tool to assign a GPU. And later it will convert the image into multiple different sections. And by the way, this process might take about two minutes or so and make sure that you are actually using an account in Hugging Face because if you are not using or log into this platform, then you you won't have enough GPU uh, duration to actually process the image. So just make sure to create a free account on this platform. Anyway, I'll just skip forward and I'll show you the result. Okay, so this is the result. And interestingly, we have two different options. You can download the files as a PPTX format, which is interesting, but you can also download them as an individual image file. And now they are going to be in the in the archive zip file. So it's up to you which format that you prefer. But in this case, I'll try both of them. So if I click the zip version, then I'll get a zip file. And in that file, it might contain multiple different items like this one but what's interesting is if i'm using the pptx version because now i can show you how the individual elements are actually stacking together it's very interesting and looks really cool so let me just open that document and there you go so it looked like the same image and no surprise but it is actually just multiple elements on top of another let me just enable uh, editing and there you go i can actually move around this particular picture and as you can see it is separated from the background so let me just uh, put this to the left and this one is going to be to the right top right and then this is going to be bottom left there you go and lastly it was the background there you go so one two three four this one is well that's kind of unique because it is actually separating the watermark which well i guess it could happen but yeah these are different pictures based on one picture that i just processed using the quen image layer so that's how you can use it and i think this could be quite useful especially if you don't want to manually uh, select or separate different elements using tools like photoshop with, which could take quite some time so yeah now uh, just go ahead and navigate to this page and then you can try this ai model yourself thanks for watching and i'll see you on my next video i wish you a great day ahead